Hi, we would like to share this video presentation with you. Dr. Codoni and myself have no disclosure to make. Hi, we would like to share this uh, water added colonoscopy presentation. In this video presentation, we would like to demonstrate how to perform water added colonoscopy with differences between water immersion and water exchange. Water added colonoscopy encompasses different techniques entailing infusion of water as an adjunct to R in lieu of gas insufflation to distend the lumen during insertion, which is accomplished with insufflation turned off. Water immersion is an unstandardized technique in which water is infused to facilitate cecal intubation without maximizing cleanliness. Insufflation is resumed and used in limited amounts when necessary. Water exchange is modified from water immersion and is a standardized technique that through infusion and near simultaneous suction of water entails substituting all colon content with a layer of clear water allowing gasless instrument progression to the cecum. With both techniques, withdrawal is carried out using insufflation. There are numerous advantages of water aided colonoscopy. In the left lateral position, infusing water in a gasless lumen straightens the sigmoid colon, allowing an easier passage into the descending colon. The colon is not elongated, bends and flexures are smoother and easier to negotiate. There are randomized controlled trials that suggest that, compared with gas insufflation, water-aided colonoscopy significantly increases cecal intubation rate, significantly decreases real-time and recall pain and sedation requirement with high patient satisfaction and willingness to repeat the procedure. Water exchange is the least painful insertion technique significantly increases colon cleanliness, significantly increases adenoma detection rate, not in the left colon, but also in the right colon. We put together a sequence of video clips in both technique. On the left side is water immersion, and on the right side is water exchange. In both techniques, water is infused. The difference is in water immersion, Water is infused, but residual colon prep and air pockets not aspirated by bypass to speed up cecal intubation. But on the right hand side in water exchange, all the water is infused, but suction carried out at the same time that entails substituting all colon content with a layer of clear water, allowing instrument progression to the cecum, maximizing cleanliness and minimizing distension. In water exchange, the suction port is kept in the middle of the lumen to avoid capturing of mucosa. But if there is a capturing of mucosa, slightly withdrawing the instrument helps release the mucosa from the suction channel port. Once the cecum is reached, it is thoroughly washed and then withdrawal in both technique is carried out using insufflation. You will see the appendiceal landmark on the right side and on the left side now. During withdrawal, you will see in the water immersion technique, there is pond of dirty fluid in the colon that has to be aspirated. But on the right hand side, withdrawal with water exchange, 
bowel is very clean, that we believe is the likely reason that we pick more pathology using water exchange technique in colonoscopy. In conclusion, we demonstrated water immersion and water exchange techniques in this video presentation. Water immersion is easier to learn. It might be indicated for unsedated or minimally sedated diagnostic patients that have less colon lesions, making a quick examination as comfortable as possible. On the other hand, water exchange requires a training period but outperforms the other techniques for several outcomes and may have an important role in improving the quality of screening colonoscopy. Thank you very much.